Hey, what is going on, guys? This is Nick here, giving you a Letter Boom Beach video. Today we'll be doing base tips, and you're probably wondering, where am I? Oh, exactly. Well, this is my room, my YouTubing room, right now with the computer design to my desk, which is what I'm doing it on. So, with that over it. So at the end, today we'll be doing base tips. Again, this this will be good for the low level people, and maybe this will be good for the high level people to know, like review, like what it was like when you were just level nine. So let's hope we don't have the complete fail again. If you watched that video, complete fail on Boom Beach tips on Boom Beach that video. I think that's how it's called. But I don't know for sure, so I don't know everything. But but let's get started. So 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 we will be doing base tips on how you will set up your base as a good base. I'll be explaining during the way. So let's get started. So this the maximum of this video. As you see, I set it up a base for the experiment. Right now, I set it up the base for the experiment. The HU is upgrading, and every one of the base tips are never leave everything close together. If something's like touching your HQ, that's a bad thing because then when they hit, they can hit right here an artillery shot, and they can do damage to your HQ and get free shot at it. So let's have everything that's there go a little apart from it. So now everything is apart. Well, not every. Now everything is apart. Uh, to make a good base, don't leave your mind all together. People can just go boom, 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 and they can destroy all your minds, which are level two. They're level two. I didn't even notice. But this is level two. Who? And base tip number three: never leave so many digs together. Where some you just add in the open like this, like this fragments right here. Just because things are in range doesn't mean just because you put it first, the things aren't in range. So that means you should put it behind. Like behind the defense, and so you should leave it behind where at least something has range. Tip number three or four: Never leave everything so close together. You see how like each and every building is basically touching, except the ones that are near the HQ. So, so we're gonna spread everything out. So we're gonna do that. So let's spread everything out so that way people can't just one shot our buildings. So let's split that up, put that there, put that there. And this is also in front, which I just noticed. That. But you can only put a building in front of it if you want to protect it. That's the other reason. Rule number, tip number three. Oh. Never put your HQ so far in the front. That will just give everyone the opportunity to just, if they want to, they, it'll give everyone the opportunity to just destroy it here without really having to face any defenses. So let's move our HQ back. So let's move our HQ back. And also, try to get each and every weapon into good use. Like this more back here, it won't really be doing anything. So we're gonna switch with this, if we can. We're gonna switch to that. On. Put the mortar there. So we're gonna try to include all our, we our weapons, which is right now. So, so right now you can get a little defense, but mostly the mortar and sniper are mostly covered on that. 
But now with the mo oh my gosh, I just learned. now with the mines. Never keep your mind so close, like till they're like overlapping, kinda. You can put an artillery shot, boom, boom, ba boom, there. So let's move these mines a little bit apart. So we we can't. So this whoever attacks won't artillery shot them all. They won't be able to with all the mines spread out. So let's try to keep these mines spreaded. So this is. A good base for you. What? Oh my gosh, I just saw that. <laughs> so let's inspect the base. Oh. So let's check our base. Alright, as I see nothing, which is fine. And when your gunboat is level one, that little cannon there. <laughs> just so you know. <laughs> it's so beauty. Even though it's only level five. <laughs> my gunboat is like level 13 at my level but you can't upgrade it then it really has its turrets going all right anyway anyway so let's get this part going hold on and when i get rid of this ad the computer because i want to see so so anyway as i was saying i will give you a nice zoom in the space Alright, that's all for now. What island do we lose? Oh, we've been raided. So, like, this is what happens when you have everything so close together. This is not the experiment. See how he got. Well, he didn't do the free. See how I destroyed those two snipers together? That's a good mistake. And he's doing the Ruka attack strategy. I'm surprised. And see what I mean? How it, see what I mean? Like nothing can defend that. Now our new oh, you even our ships. Wait, he he's stronger than us. I think. Yeah, this guy's stronger than us. Just look. at... Look, I'm letting you all see what's going on. You're lucky about that. See how he's just getting all my the free gumbo energy? That's not what we want. We want him to go after something other than that. Because that's really the whole point. And buildings do take up a lot of damage when... So the machine gun does its job. Well, our level 1 machine gun will be the... Burn. Maybe it won't be the OP. See what I mean? How, like. Okay. Don't worry about that. So we still have base tips. Like, when. When you attack. Like, this attack. You can really. Outrange everything. Actually. Yeah, let's do this. I'll destroy the flamethrower. It'll be sad. It'll be sad. Here, look. I'm just saying to show you an example. Never just go with one troop. Always go with more than one. But, so that's, so don't worry about that. That was just a fake attack for us. Let's see how we done. So, that's why I never go all heavies. But, that's not really what matters right now. Though. But, those real, well, really the whole point of the base tips were, seriously, if you were watching this, the whole point of the base tips were, well, do you really, I probably will show you, well, it depends if it dies. <laughs> Which we don't want to happen again. So, maybe we will. Let's see. So, we did base tips. What else is there to do? Let me think. Oh, yeah. Try, when you upgrade stuff, it give. Hold on. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry about that. 
Hey guys, the box tissues finally opened. You never know what I'll need it. All right, so I'm gonna give it to the. So right now, I'm gonna give the camera to not me. Right now, I'm gonna give it to the computer again, and we will. And I will show you. I will show you the our. Um, I'll show you the what I'm trying to talk about. So, it, so that's my fish there. <laughs> if you didn't want, if you wanted to see it, Do don't mind if you did. If you wanted to, all right. Try to upgrade some. Try to upgrade some. Try to upgrade like something like this a day. Cause try to upgrade something like this a day because the whole reason of it, hold on, the whole reason of it is so that way you can get more of these, of this, of your, of your level. So you can get higher into getting like to level 21 or level 30 or whatever you need to get to. You can get to it faster when you upgrade stuff. So what I would say is, for this base tip, don't worry about him. What I would say is, probably just, probably just upgrade at least one thing a day. Now today I upgrade two things, but that doesn't matter right now. Right now what that matters is, at least you upgrade one thing a day. So that way you can get higher and higher. But if you get rated, that's why try not like when your be when your resource collection makes them, try to leave it leg collect up until you actually need it. Cause then if you have a bunch of resources, you're gonna be attacked sooner. And you don't wanna be attacked sooner. So Especially if you're a high level, and yet let's say you're saving up for your HQ, don't collect as much resources as you can. Wait, wait for it, cause you don't, cause you don't want to go overloading. You don't want to be full of wood or whatever you need. So just don't do it. That's a letter base tip for you. So I think this that will really. Well, am I missing something? Yeah, just upgrade one thing a day. But when you come to the level or experience that you need, like, all right, I want to actually show you something. Sometimes I will do this. Okay, so we're doing this again. So, so sometimes I rename things. This I call sometimes. Actually, that I always call short, shorter. This I call Volley. It's now called the Barrage to me. This is called the Barrage to me. This is called the Shock. In operations, I'll call this the Pellet. Although I won't always call it the Pellet, but mostly I probably will. This I call Sponges. This I call Rocket Ladies. And that's really it, okay? I just want you to have that in mind. So when we watch my video, I won't have, like, rocket ladies. And you'll go, like, what in the world are rocket ladies? <laughs> Until I show you. Anyway, that will wrap it up today because the tablet's running. This is, this here, this here is running low on battery. Did you get a good pick on that? See, it's low battery. <laughs> I get show it right to you. Okay. So, I will see you guys. I will see you guys later.